This video is about binary addition overflow. Now I covered binary addition in a previous video, so this is mostly about overflow. What's an overflow? An overflow is where the amount of space allocated for the result after maybe a binary addition, the amount of space allocated is not big enough and the result goes over the amount of space allocated. So let's provide some more detail to that. Let's say I want to add these four bit numbers, uh, four bit numbers or nibbles together. So that's four bits, that's four bits. And then I've only allocated four bits for the answer, okay? Because anything other than that, then I'll run out of space. Let's do the maths. One plus nothing, well, that's a one. One plus nothing, that's a one. One plus nothing, that's one. One plus a one, I drop a zero, and then I, wait a minute, I carry a one, and that has to drop down. So now I've got an overflow error. I only allocated four bits for the answer, but actually the answer is one, two, three, four, five bits. That is an overflow error. And what does it mean? What does it mean? Well, if, if this was coded on a game, it might mean that the game will crash. Or it might mean uh, that there are calculation errors in the game. Or if this overflow error ha happened as part of a, a Fitbit watch or whatever, then it means the Fitbit might calculate my numbers wrong or my, my or run or workout would be wrong, or maybe it will just crash altogether. So overflow errors uh, need to be avoided. And that's it, that's all it is. In this case, it's uh, normally, we're just using binary addition to show the overflow error. What's an overflow error? Where the answer after a binary addition is too big for the amount of allocated space. Now remember, developers allocate space to their running programs all the time. If you don't allocate space, then maybe, because you want to keep your code efficient, all right? And so if you need allocate just enough space, to keep your code efficient. Otherwise, if your code's too big, then games and things like this will run onto multiple disks and that would be annoying.